Adam again on Outdoor Adam. Uh, I'm just going to continue the kit review, which I've just edited the main video because the quality of the camera went pretty poor. And it's quite dark, so where I got up to with the power cord, I think. I will continue from there, which I've got out the um, billy tins, which everyone you knows, you know, you get pans, which are the lids as well, and you get three pans inside that medium small large which I haven't even used yet so I'll be getting to use those um, I'm going to show you this well a sleeping bag don't look like one obviously but it's in a waterproof bag the ones that you clip and roll and it's a bit better than obviously having a dustbin bag and well yeah lasts for longer it doesn't rip and it keeps it nice and dry out of the out of the wet weather really um got my Gore-Tex gaiters you know self-explanatory if you know what they are and I've got my British Army issued bivvy bag excellent obviously waterproof put inside just put your sleeping bag inside um got here got my, got my roll mat it's a Van Gogh adventure standard you know self-inflating roll mat I have to check for obviously punches and repairs before I go and do what is needed if it is repa needs repairing. 120 litre British DPM rucksack. Excellent bit of kit that is, goodbye. Um, shelter wise, I've got standard size basher. And the picture quality has gone poor, so I'll get this over and done real quickly. And a ground sheet. But there we go. I do apologise for the poor quality. The next videos will be a lot better. As you can see, it's going all fuzzy. Just a rubbish camera, I suppose. <laughs> but we'll be getting a new one and uploading more videos of the trip. So, but thanks for watching, and uh, shall see you soon.